Hi folks, today we're here to talk about the four parameters of friction steer welding. So if you're not so familiar with friction steer welding, I encourage you to watch our first episode, Friction Steer Welding for Dummies for the Basic Principles. The first parameter for friction steer welding is the friction steer welding tool. The key points about friction steer welding tool is first the material of the tool, which will be different depending on the alloy that we want to weld. Then we have the size of the tool, we have first the length of the friction steer welding pin, which will give the weld penetration. And linked to it, we have the shoulder diameter, which will apply the heat by friction. Now that we have the right friction steer welding tool, we can explore the three remaining parameters, which will be driven by the friction steer welding program. The second parameter is the rotation speed, which will depend on the size of the tool that we just selected and on the material that we want to weld. Now that we have the friction steer welding tool and the rotation speed, we must determine the friction steer welding Z-load. It is reached when the pin fully penetrates into the material and that we have the shoulder in contact with the part surface. So we do successive plunges into the material until we clearly see the shape of the shoulder on the surface of the part. Now we have the right friction steer welding Z load. We can go to the last parameter to be determined, which is the welding speed. To get the fourth parameter, which is a feed rate, it is important to take into account the rotation speed because the ratio between rotation speed and welding speed is very important. To have a suitable weld, we should make a certain number of rounds per traveled millimeter. My parameter determination is now finished as I have the friction steer welding tool, the rotation speed, the Z load and the feed rate. If you want some more free content about friction steer welding parameters, please go to the description. And if you need to go further in the details, please contact us to book a dedicated training.